Okay, so for today activity, we're going to do a Photoshop brush. What you have to do is you go to the Google and then find any fruit, orange, okay, watermelon, okay, apple and so on. Okay, so just want to create new file, find new. Okay, just click OK. And then, just create a background. Okay, gradient. Okay, this is the brush, the tool brush, brush tool. Okay, look at this brush tool. Okay, what you have to do, you need to download the ABR file. Okay, you already download and save the file at your desktop. And then this is the basic brush that you have here, basic. Okay, I want to uh, load, I want to load the brush that I download before. So I go to this setting, okay, go to this setting and then go to the load brush. Okay, click here, load brush. Okay, I want to upload this uh, file. This is the Photoshop brush that I downloaded before, cute face. And then I just click open. And automatically, I get this uh, cute face. I repeat, so this is the brush. Okay, go to the brush tool. Okay, this is the basic, basic brush that you have in the Photoshop. Okay, let's say I want to add a new brush. Just go to the load brush. And then I just select the ABR file. And then I click open and automatically I get the, uh, the brush that I want. Okay, so this is a two example here. Cute face and water splash. Okay, now. Okay, I have a watermelon here. Okay. Just drag watermelon. Okay, as usual, delete the white background. Okay, I can adjust the size. Okay, I can play with the angle, so on. Okay. So, what are the function of the brush? Okay. Okay, I just click the brush and then the water splash is number 1053, I think. Okay, this one. Okay. So this, this size is too big. Okay, you need to adjust here. Okay. Okay, is it okay? Can you see that? Okay. It will give you the different effect. Okay. And then I try to find another something like emoji lah, something like that. Okay. Okay, so this one. Get another one. Okay, then you can add text. Okay, you can add any text. Okay, happiness for is watermelon. Okay, so you can change the size, type, so on. Okay. Control T and just drag. Okay, drag. Okay, this is the how we use the stroke. You right click, blending option, and then go to stroke. Okay, this is stroke. Okay, you can adjust the size here. Okay, it's not too big. I think one or two is uh, good enough. Okay, the position inside, outside. Okay, and then you also can use this uh, shadow. You can play with the distance and size. Okay, or inner glow. Okay, this is inner glow. You can change the color also. 
okay, you can play with this option. Right, so what is the outer glow? What is drop shadow? Ah, this is drop shadow. You can play with the size here. Okay, can you see the shadow? <laughs> okay, the distance. Okay, you see? Okay. Yeah. Okay, same like uh, watermelon. You also can adjust the shadow. Okay. And Mostly, ah, uh, we can use a drop shadow. Okay, let's see. Oops. Okay, I think that's okay. So it's very simple. You can get, uh, you can create your poster. You can create any of design just using a brush. Okay. So any question about this brush? Okay, can you see this picture? Okay, this is one example. Yes, madam. Uh, okay. Uh, apple, pear. Okay, and then just add the water splash and what the uh, face and the text. Okay, this is one example. This is another one. Actually, you need to be creative. Okay. Uh, this one, this student. Uh, <laughs> the, the text actually, you need to be creative. Okay, outside. Okay, this is uh, hot, right? Fire. So it's very hot. Ouch. Uh, okay, this watermelon and mango, I think this one. Watermelon, red and yellow. Okay. Uh, I think uh, after this, you can try and then you can share your picture at Telegram. Is it okay? Can you do that? You have a weekend? Saturday and Sunday? Bye.